the majority of my time was spent with the nurses. And it wasn't just the physical treatment that really helped me through. It was the emotional treatment. It was overcoming the fear. Just being there for these patients, some of them have nobody else to get through this cancer experience. And sometimes it's only us, the nurses, that help them through this. And that's what I love about oncology. My name is Jeremy Newman, and I am a cancer survivor. My name is Elizabeth Day, and I am a cancer survivor. My name is Marilyn Gordon, and I am a cancer survivor. I was diagnosed uh, approximately 10 years ago with head and neck cancer. I was treated with surgery. We monitored it closely for the next year. And after that, I was going to clean bill of health. There were times where I was quite scared. They helped with the fear, um, helped talk you through the uncertainty of what was going to happen. Uh, and all around, they were just a friendly face that you could turn to and look forward to seeing every morning, afternoon, and evening. Every patient is an individual, and we use our skills to listen and assess but we anticipate where patients are going to be and what their needs are going to be. And we're comfortable in those very uncomfortable places with those uncomfortable discussions. And it's cliche to say, but I really think that we make a real difference in our patients and family lives. I was diagnosed um, close to eight years ago. My diagnosis was breast cancer. The treatment I received was lumpectomy, uh, radiation, and uh, chemotherapy, and also homotherapy. I'm glad that I didn't go through the journey all by myself. I have this supporting um, oncology nurses. He's always there for me to answer my questions. Thank you, a big thank you to you, my oncology nurses. You did a great job and you helped me a lot. What drives me is, uh, you know, getting the compliments from patients saying, um, you've made the biggest difference in my life or you've helped save my life. And those are the kinds of things that uh, keep me going, that keep me here. You're helping them in a point in their lives where um, disaster in their mind has hit and uh, I feel like I'm helping them through a life-changing experience. Like, I love oncology, I love everything about um, helping patients through this experience and uh, making sure that I'm there um, through some of their very, very vulnerable moments. I was diagnosed with uterine cancer in 1994, that was 21 years ago, and I had total hysterectomy. So right now, I'm cancer-free, and I'm really happy and enjoying my life with my family. After my surgery, the nurses were so great and do a really great job, and they helped me through. What am I passionate about in oncology? I think the challenges of all the new therapies and the more promising um, uh, avenues that patients can pursue now with cancer treatment because we do have more treatments. It makes me feel so gratified and so happy to be able to assist patients uh, when they're in their direst need and to see families, um, they give their gratitude back to you. I love being here. It's everything I want it to be and everything I can imagine have been. 